Hi, guys and ladies. I was listening to a podcast called The Splendid Table where they interviewed a chef who extolled the deliciousness of soy sauce with butter on fish. Well, I found no exact recipe like that online, so I'm just going to have to make one up out of thin air. And the only thing I need is, you guessed it, the fish. I'm going to make my first cast right here off the dock. In a recent video, I used a Z-Man creature thing called a boar hogs. Well, this is a smaller version called a TRD hogs. And I wonder if we could catch enough bass for our recipe with this thing. Uh, look in the notes below for info on my equipment, the lake, the fish, everything. Let's go fishing. You know, if it's under 12 inches, I'm allowed to keep it. Read why in the notes below. It's the opposite of all other lakes probably in the country, but here we are. I think this is an eater. Yeah, it's 11 inches. That's gonna be perfect. Oh, there's a fish. There was this fish on for quite a long time. I didn't know it was on. I thought, I thought the line felt a little funny, so I said, you know, I'll pull hard. And look, I don't believe it. It's exactly 11 inches like the last one. Oh, I got one right at the boat. Right at the boat. Right at the boat. What a little guy. I'm sorry, fans. I'd like to catch big fish for you all the time. <laughs> 10 inches. I need to call them. Wow. He just pulled it out of my hand. That's more what I'm going for. He pulled that thing right out of my hand. I mean, I almost lost the reel. 11 and 5 eighths. Perfect. <sighs> Nothing big, but good enough to eat, I think. 10 and a half inches. <laughs> I'm getting little ones on every cast. This one's a little bit bigger. I haven't even shown you all the little ones I've caught. They're just hitting on every cast today. Ten and a half inches again. Uh -oh. I got a fish and a log at the same time. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Every cast I'm catching little fish. Unbelievable. I had the branch and the fish at the same time. Ten and a half inches again. Crazy, crazy day. It's been so hard to fish today. The, the winds are gusting at like 50 miles an hour. Oh, all right. 
About time I caught a bigger fish. 14 and 3 quarters inches. I've got 3 and 3 quarters pounds of fish uh, here on this stringer. And even an average fish filleter is going to get at least a third of that in fillet. So that's going to be well over a pound. <laughs> Let's get in the house and get started filleting these guys. Yesterday was weird. We're in a drought. The water was as clear as Lake Catcher Big One gets and the wind was gusting. But despite all, we caught tons of little bass. Here I have just a pound and a quarter of these little bass fillets from almost two pounds that we produce. I want to get to cooking them, but first let's do a little side dish that keeps our soy sauce theme going. I've never done this before. I'm supposed to cut cucumbers very, very thin. Well, I don't have knife skills, so I have this spiralizer with this uh, blade, and maybe this will do the trick. Let's see. Look, oh. sort of uh, sliced. I just have to cut these every thousand yards. Let me do it now. Look it, see how nice these came out? All I'm going to do is pat them dry a little bit. A little bit, not much. I'm trying to toast a couple teaspoons of sesame seeds here. Oh no, I was in the other room. I completely forgot about my sesame seeds. I hope I didn't make them too toasty. See what happens when you get old? Oh. They're toasty, but they're not bad, they're good. Mm. In a medium bowl, whisk together all other ingredients and add the cucumbers. Mm. Going in first, two tablespoons of rice wine vinegar. Now a heaping tablespoon of sesame seed oil. Here's three teaspoons of light soy sauce. Here's about a third teaspoon of salt. I worry about salt because of the soy sauce. Our toasted sesame seeds. This is just guesswork. Red pepper flakes, I don't know, half teaspoon? Our thinly sliced cucumbers. As I'm stirring this all up, you could really get a whiff of that nice sesame oil. Mm. Oh, I can assure you, you're going to love this. You get that wonderful sesame flavor, a, a tad of heat but that's offset by the coolness of the cucumber and you get that umami savoriness of the soy sauce. Try this, but now I worry about the fish. Let's get on to that. In this bag, I've got a cup and a half of almond flour and our bass fillets. I'm just gonna dust up our little buddies. No egg wash. I just want a light coating to add a little texture, you know? You could use a uh, regular flour, I'm just making this up. I don't know how it's going to turn out. I'm setting the skillet to medium high. I've got six tablespoons of butter in it. Our butter's turning brown. Let's get our fillets in there. So I'm going to do these two minutes on the first side and about a minute and a half, two minutes on the second side. It's been two minutes. Let's flip. I've got four tablespoons of light soy sauce here. Minute and a half more. I'm adding even more. Another couple tablespoons. Okay, it's been a minute and a half. I'm taking them off. Here's our fish. I'm just gonna have a little piece now. Hmm, it's a little salty. No, oh, but this is really good. That's not that bad. It's not salty. Well, maybe a little. Mm, maybe a little less soy. Oh, but I think it's good. <laughs> I'm going to keep it warm in the oven. It's really good. 
Mm. You know, that fish tasted very good. It had so much flavor. It was like bursting with flavor. The only thing I might change is to increase the butter a little and maybe reduce the soy sauce because it did have a bit of saltiness to it, but it was so good. While our fish are keeping warm in the oven, well, I have to tell you of my excitement. I have a special guest joining me for dinner tonight. It's the famous celebrity restaurant and food critic, Miss Lulu Cheeks. Well, the only thing is that Despite our seeing each other for decades, she doesn't seem to appreciate the benefits that marriage would offer her. And I don't know what to do. Well, here we are once again with the famous celebrity restaurant and food critic, Miss Lulu Cheeks. Thank you so much for joining me for dinner at my uh, <clears throat> disheveled double wide. And you had a chance to ingest my cucumber salad. What did you think of that? A mm. sesame salad. Oh, it was very good. That was delicious. So refreshing. It was. Refreshing. I really enjoyed it. Yeah. Yes, thank you. And then we had uh, my bass fillets in soy butter sauce. Yes. What did you think? Very good. Very good. You modestly described them, but they were outstanding. They, they were very good. They were full yeah. of flavor. Maybe next time we'll use unsalted butter because yeah, but, that was your suggestion. Yeah, and then you can all, make sure you use a lot of lemon juice. That helps. And the it. lemon that helped a lot. That yeah. was a very, very, mm -hmm. very good idea. Now, you, you know, Miss Lou, oh, I, I may address yes. you by your first name yes. now. Uh, um, a, a woman will never know what happiness is until she marries. Ah, uh, yes, but then it's too late. Huh? Uh, can I have a hug?